Dakota Mae Johnson was born on October 4, 1989, at Brackenridge Hospital in Austin, Texas, to actors Don Johnson and Melanie Griffith. Her father was shooting the film The Hot Spot, 1990, in Texas when she was born. Her maternal grandparents are advertising executive and former child actor Peter Griffith and actress Tippi Hedren. She is a half-niece of actress Tracy Griffith and production designer Clay A. Griffith. Her former stepfather is actor Antonio Banderas. Johnson has a complex family as each of her parents had children by three different people. Her six half-siblings are Jesse Johnson, born in 1982, from her father's relationship with Patty Darbinville, Alexander Bauer, born in 1985, from her mother's marriage to Stephen Bauer, Stella Banderas, born in 1996, from her mother's marriage to Antonio, Grace, born in 1999, Jasper, born in 2002, and Deacon Johnson, born in 2006, from her father's marriage to Kelly Flager. Owing to her parents' occupations, Johnson spent much of her childhood in various locations with them on film sets and premieres, though she spent extended amounts of time in Aspen and Woody Creek, Colorado, where she worked during summers at the local market as a teenager. In Woody Creek, she was neighbors with Hunter S. Thompson. She attended the Aspen Community School for a time. I was so consistently unmoored and discombobulated, I didn't have an anchor anywhere, Johnson recalled. She attended the Santa Catalina School in Monterey, California, for her freshman year of high school before transferring to the private New Road School in Santa Monica, California. Johnson became interested in modeling at age 12 after taking part in a photo shoot with other celebrities' children for Teen Vogue and subsequently earned an income modeling while attending high school in Santa Monica. She has struggled with depression since around age 14 and checked into rehabilitation. She also has had ADHD since childhood. Johnson was interested in acting as a child, having spent significant time on film sets with her parents, but they discouraged her from pursuing the profession until she graduated high school. After high school, she applied to Juilliard, performing monologues by Shakespeare and Steve Martin, but was not accepted. Johnson was previously involved in long-term relationships with Noah Gersh and actor Jordan Masterson. She dated Matthew Hitt, the lead vocalist of Welsh indie rock band Drowners, intermittently for almost two years until 2016. She has been in a relationship with Coldplay's vocalist Chris Martin since October 2017. They reside in Malibu, California. They are engaged. Johnson is a tattoo enthusiast and has been named a brand ambassador for luxury fashion brand Gucci. In November 2020, it was announced that she had become an investor and co-creative director of Maud, a sexual wellness brand. In 2018, she collaborated with 300 women in Hollywood to set up the Time's Up initiative to protect women from harassment and discrimination. In 1999, Johnson made her film debut in Crazy in Alabama, where she and her half-sister Stella Banderas played daughters to their real-life mother, Melanie Griffith. The film was directed by her ex-stepfather, Antonio Banderas. In 2006, she was chosen as Miss Golden Globe 2006, where she sinned 2006. Johnson signed with IMG Models. Though acting is her primary work, she has since modeled for Mango Brands Jeans Line in 2009 and shot the Rising Star campaign for Australian fashion label Wish in 2011. After graduating from high school, Johnson took acting classes with teacher Tom Todorov until 2008. She signed with the William Morris Agency and started her acting career. She had a minor role as Amelia Ritter in the Oscar-nominated hit film The Social Network, 2010, directed by David Fincher. She had a small role in the fantasy film Beastly, 2011, followed by So Young Kim's drama for Ellen, 2012, opposite Paul Dano and John Heater, about a struggling musician in the midst of a custody battle. Also in 2012, she had roles in Christopher Neal's independent comedy Goats, playing a student at a prep school, Nicholas Stoller's romantic comedy The Five-Year Engagement, 
and the comedy 21, Jump Street. She also played the female lead in Chris Nelson's Film Date and Switch Written by Alan Young. In March 2012, Johnson was cast as Kate in the Fox comedy series Ben and Kate, marking her television debut. The show was canceled on January 25, 2013, after one season. Johnson quickly resumed her film career with a small role in Need for Speed, 2014. In 2013, she had a role as one of the new hires on the series finale episode of the NBC comedy series The Office. E. Johnson founded the production company Tea Time Pictures, alongside former Netflix development executive Ro Donnelly, to develop film and television projects. In 2020, Johnson made her directorial debut, co-directing with Corey Bailey, the music video for Coldplay's Cry, 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 which featured her boyfriend, Chris Martin. Johnson starred alongside Tracy Ellis Ross in the dramedy film The High Note, which was released on May 29, 2020. And Hornaday of The Washington Post wrote that she's lovely to look at and can never be accused of overacting, but in terms of conveying single-minded drive, Johnson is no match for Tracy Ellis. Ross's carefully calibrated tonal swings between imperiousness, self-awareness, isolation, and down-to-earth intimacy. Conversely, Richard Roper of the Chicago Sun-Times saw it as maybe her best and certainly most lovable performance. In 2021, she co-starred in The Lost Daughter directed by Maggie Gyllenhaal, based on the novel of the same name by Elena Ferrante. In December 2021, Boat Rocker Media acquired a minority interest in Johnson's Tea Time Pictures Company. In 2022, she starred in a Netflix adaptation of author Jane Austen's Persuasion. She co-produced and starred in several films, As a Lesbian in Am I Okay? by Stephanie Lynn and Tig Notaro, and As a Young Mother with an Autistic Child in Cha Cha Real Smooth by Cooper Rafe and in Daddio. In November 2023, Johnson departed WME and signed a representation deal with Creative Artists Agency. She plays the title role in the superhero film Madam Web, set in Sony's Spider-Man universe. It was produced on a budget of $80 million and was critically panned but was also deemed a future cult classic. On February 15, 2015, Johnson appeared on Saturday Night Live's 40th anniversary special and hosted SNL on February 28, 2015, making her the second daughter of a former SNL host, after Gwyneth Paltrow, whose mother Blythe Danner hosted during the show's seventh season in 1982, to host the show. Also in 2015, she reunited with her 21, Jump Street cast member Johnny Depp, playing the mother of his character's child in the feature film Black Massachusetts, Jessica King of IndieWire said that she makes something of nothing in her role. In 2015, Johnson starred in Luca Guadagnino's Thriller A Bigger Splash, alongside Tilda Swinton, Matthias Skunertz, and Ralph Fiennes. Writing for Rolling Stone, Peter Travers stated that Johnson showed that her character has more on her mind than slithering seductively. According to Christy Lemire from RogerEbert.com, a bigger splash allows Johnson to be both funnier and sexier than she was in Fifty Shades of Grey. The same year saw the release of Cymbeline, a modern film adaptation of the William Shakespeare play, in which she starred opposite Ethan Hawke and Ed Harris. She also played a lead in the 2016 comedy How to Be Single with Leslie Mann and her date and Switch co-star Nicholas Braun. She performed a cover of the song Can't Take My Eyes Off of You alongside actors Zonny jones Bays, Vanessa Rubio, and Damon Wayans Jr. for the soundtrack of the film. Johnson was invited to join the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences in June 2016 as the first second-generation Miss Golden Globe in the Globe's history.